Only the faithful make the trek out in the elements to see Quinnipiac take on Colgate. The Bobcats came out hitting. Spencer Heikman puts the lick on the Colgate defender in the first, but it's scoreless through one. We move to the second now. Connor Jones, the quick wrist shot as he gains the zone, beats the Colgate goalie, so the Bobcats take a one to nothing lead. We are still in the second period, and the Raiders on the attack this time. Jack McNamara the shot. It deflects right to Robbie Borden, who gets the puck, bounces it off the post, and we're tied at one. But the Bobcats aren't done in the period. Connor Jones with a blast, bounces into the corner. Russell Goodman centers the pass to Jones, flips it to Ben Arndt for the go-ahead score. Take another look. Jones with a no-look, and Arndt slides it just under the glove of Colgate's Brian Bissett. So with 7.27 left in the second, Quinnipiac leads it 2-1. to one. That score would hold into the third, where Eric Hartzell preserves the lead. An amazing save. Help from Mike Dahlheisen, who sweeps the puck clear. Less than a minute left. Colgate pulls the goaltender. Quinnipiac Scott Zerabinski intercepts the pass. Jeremy Langloy gathers the bouncing puck and flips it into the empty net. Bobcats would go up 3-1, to one, and that's your final. And that's your ctnow.com extended highlights for this week. I'm Bob Rumble.